As always, this is a 100% cotton t-shirt that's been soaked in soda ash for at least 20 minutes and then spun out in the washing machine until it's just damp. Now the shirt's already been flipped inside out and we're just going to start with a simple spiral and you can put that anywhere you want on here. So I'm just going to pick slightly up a little and then just start a spiral. Okay, so once that's ready, I'll go ahead and pick a spot. I'm not paying attention to the rubber bands, they're just kind of on there. And come out, move this just a little bit. And I'm marking a section about that large. I'm actually going to cut this down in half as well. So that I end up with four lines there. Everything else, for the most part, we're just going to ignore um, as far as actual placement of anything. Alright, off to die. All right, for this we're using Robin's Egg Blue, Bluebird, Strong Navy, Nebula Navy, and Deep Space, and those are all from Dharma, and Royal Blue from Custom Colors, and Marine Blue from Grateful Dyes. So let's get started. Alright, I'm going to add a little soda ash over the top of this. Alright, I'm going to let that melt through and then we'll come back and do the next step. All right, it's basically melted through, so let's go ahead and do the next step. Add a little soda ash. And then I'm going to start with the colors.
and we'll just let this melt through. It's been probably about 36 hours or more, so let's go ahead and give this a wash out. Look. Go throw that in the washing machine and we'll get a final look. Alrighty, here are the final results. Front and back. So what do I think? pretty close to what I was shooting for. I probably should have only done one band of the Bluebird, which is this one, um, and left the rest um, for that pie section as the Robin's Egg Blue. That would have made this lighter, which was what I was looking for, or maybe just the Robin's Egg by itself. Um, it's kind of buried in there on the sides. And this is part robin's egg and part white. It's really hard to discern between the two. Uh, and then we have the black here in the center. I do like how it is not like a solid piece, but it's actually like split apart. I like that. And then the other colors kind of all blended together. I mean, you can see slight differences um, in the areas, but overall it's, it's pretty much um, that type of color. But still, it has the general idea of what I was going for. I'm happy with the results. So let me know what you think down below. And as always, thanks for watching.